I would like to discuss a very common eyelid condition called blepharitis. Blepharitis means inflammation of the eyelids. I see it in many of my patients and it is a frequent cause of dry, irritated eyes and the formation of styes and cysts called chalasia. The cause of blepharitis is frequently related to the sensitivity of a person's skin to the small particles that land on the eyelashes throughout the day. The eyelashes are there to protect the eye from debris that float through the air. These tiny particles may land on the lashes and form crusts, which can be seen under the examination room microscope. This debris is made up of irritants, like pollen and dust, oils and mucus, and old makeup. These irritants cause inflammation of the eyelids, eyelashes, and the oil glands around the eye. These cause the eyes to become red and irritated, dry, and even sometimes painful. The eyelid margins can get red and swollen. The eyelashes may fall out and grow back pointing inwards toward the eye, or they may not grow back at all. The delicate oil glands in the eyelids swell shut and get clogged, and then styes and chalasia develop. The debris can frequently get infected with bacteria to which we are all very sensitive. The bacterial infection makes the eye and eyelid inflammation even worse. If you are watching this video, it is very likely that you have blepharitis. There are many skin types which make people prone to develop blepharitis at least sometime in their lives. People with dry skin and people with oily skin frequently have some type of blepharitis. Treatment of blepharitis depends on the cause and severity of the condition. The main treatment of blepharitis is cleansing of the eyelashes to remove the debris that is causing so much irritation. There are eyelash shampoos available in stores for this purpose, but I have found that a good cleaning with a washcloth or face towel and warm water is usually enough to get most of the debris off. Cleaning every day prevents a place for the bacteria to live. You may use a warm wet compress to loosen the debris and open the clogged oil glands. Then, close your eyes and wash the eyelashes with the washcloth. Wash horizontally across the base of the eyelashes, directed right where the lashes grow from the skin. Five to 10 seconds per eye is usually enough. There are many ways people wash their eyelashes, but I don't find that scrubbing with fingers, cotton balls, Q-tips, and flat pads are thorough enough to get the stuck-on crusts off. The terry fibers of a towel work much better. Many people have been told to wash their lashes with baby shampoo, but this soap can frequently cause more irritation to the sensitive skin around the eyes. Sometimes I may recommend a special eyelash shampoo, like Sterilid Cleanser, which contains natural antibacterial ingredients. Or I may prescribe antibiotic eye ointment or even oral antibiotics to speed healing along. However, once these antibiotics are discontinued, the bacteria will return if there is still crust and debris in which to live. So, cleaning the lashes is really the main treatment of blepharitis.